Today I'll show you how to transform your desk area from this to this. I'll show you how to both expand and upgrade your desk using 3D printing. Let's get started. The base of this project, like most storm hacks, comes from IKEA. I used a shelf from an old Billy bookshelf. And if you don't already have a shelf plate, you can pick up the IKB Liva for just 3 bucks. All of the 3D models were designed to be sturdy, even when printed on a rough resolution with zero infill. This means the parts are printed with less material, while they still carry a lot of weight. Every piece is designed so it can be fastened with either wood screws, double-sided tape, just sit on by friction, so we have a lot of options. Go ahead and download the provided STL files for yourself and send them to a 3D printer. You can find the link to the files and detailed instructions in the video description. So you need to print four legs, one for each corner, and I really like how these came out strong for vertical forces, which is just what we want. I chose to fasten the legs with regular 3 by 20 mm wood screws. I also went ahead and attached furniture pads under the legs, which provides friction and thus stability. The foam grip is printed in two parts, where a knob is screwed onto the shelf, and this knob will latch onto the foam grip itself, which grabs onto the sides of your foam. Because the foam holder will feel a lot of movement, it was fastened with a wood screw as well to keep it in place. A nice feature of the foam grip is how it rotates. It holds your phone in either portrait or landscape mode. The headset hook was made to keep your headset hanging in the air, using vertical space so you have so much more room for activities. The hook itself, along with the headset, is light enough for it to sit without any extra fastening, so it simply slides onto the shelf. Last but not least, let's add a way to maintain all of the cables. Each of these cable manager holds three cables, so go ahead and print as many as you're going to need. The cable holder mounts real well with just a couple pieces of double-sided tape. And now, everything's finished. Time to put your project to use. I filled the desk extender with all my productivity tools, which cleared up a lot of space. I even had enough room to add a second monitor. All in all, this is a quick and super cheap way of adding more space and nifty feature to your desk. I like how easy and fast it was to put everything together and the possibilities of modular design. Stay tuned, as I'm already thinking about additional upgrades. As always, you can find the downloadable files and detailed build instructions in the video description. If you like this project, go ahead and hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe for more projects coming your way.